Bandai Namco recommends Xbox and PlayStation players download Elden Ring's first patch before playing. The Pokemon Company is hosting a showcase this weekend and a lesson in thievery from Mark Wahlberg as Victor Sullivan presented by Sony Interactive Entertainment. This is your Daily Fix. Presented by Sony Interactive Entertainment. Elden Ring is on everyone's mind, Twitter feed, and Google search, but as the game rolls into your time zone for release, Bandai Namco has some advice before you traverse the lands between. Announced in a news post, the 1.02 patch for PlayStation and Xbox versions of the game addresses a few issues such as controls and frame rate drops, and players are being advised by Bandai Namco that they should definitely install the update before playing. The Elden Ring 1.02 patch notes addresses key elements from improving player controls, adjustments to text, balance, and background music to fixing some other bugs that prevented Xbox wireless headsets from working properly. This patch should be installed before playing the game and players may need to manually check for an update before starting. The publisher also mentioned players should apply the patch to the digital art book and soundtrack included in the digital deluxe edition. With Elden Ring arriving today on PC and around the world across most platforms, it's important to note that players can preload the game in advance. You know, just in case. Elden Ring is getting rave reviews all across the board, like our own glowing review on the game, and even Metacritic gave it a 92. So it's a good idea to heed Bandai Namco's warning and play the game the way it's meant to be played. In other news, the Pokemon Company will be hosting a showcase on its YouTube channel this weekend for its annual Pokemon Day, and many are eager to speculate on the details of what the 14-minute pre-recording video might cover. Previously, Pokemon Presents has announced new projects testing games in the works, and many speculate that a potential tease could be a sequel to the 3DS adventure game Detective Pikachu. During the 25th anniversary of Pokemon Day, the Pokemon Presents video featured announcements of remastered versions of the fourth generations of Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl. Considering Pokemon Brilliant Diamond and Shining Pearl just recently received the Colosseum feature and the mobile game Pokemon Unite's holiday event starts on Sunday, we can expect Pokemon Day to have a ton of surprises in store for fans. And finally, the Uncharted Legacy of Thieves Collection remasters Uncharted 4 A Thieves End and Uncharted Lost Legacy into one convenient package on PlayStation 5 consoles available now. Each game focuses on Nathan Drake and Chloe Fraser, respectively, but I'd like to take a moment to spotlight one unsung ray of joy known as Victor Sullivan, aka Sully. Witness his glorious mustache in native 4K resolution on compatible 4K displays as part of the collection's fidelity mode or see those whiskers whip in the wind in breathtaking 60 frames per second in the game's performance mode. But did you know that Sully didn't always have a mustache? Wild, I know. Steal this thievery tip from a young Sully in this clip from the Uncharted movie. Two million. Going Don't once, make me do this. Going twice, and... Sully, I think you're just gonna have to buy that cross. Three million dollars it is. You better do something now. Going twice. And... Oh, this is gonna suck! Oh, that was something. You're doing great. Hang in there. Hey, Trent. Addison wanted me to take that to the vault pronto. Thanks. Sully, where are you going? There's only one rule in this game, kid. Don't get caught. Catch Sully, Nate, and Chloe teaming up for the first time in the Uncharted movie exclusively in theaters now. And that was your Games Fix for today, February 24th. For more details on Elden Ring's scheduled release across platforms and time zones, be sure to check out our article since we've got you covered. And if you need some guidance on which class to pick or a guide on co-op, be sure to check out IGN's Elden Ring Guide updated daily. Download the IGN app on all your devices, follow the Daily Fix on Snapchat, and for everything else, head on over to IGN.com. I'm Nars, and remember, to always stay fabulous.